right now companies are more focusing on their competitive advantage how can they basically um, outpace the existing competitors they have right so uh, the applications they are building right so how to go to the market as fast as possible right so uh, if you compare to competitors but the applications modern age applications what they want right now is uh, they should evolve fast that right? so they have they should have right information uh, the analytics it should be analytics power data privacy is one of the key things there right so all this stuff should be there in underlying data infrastructure for powering the applications right but applications are evolving but the data infrastructure is still on legacy right so age old uh, relational databases so what we basically need the enterprises need right so is more of a data platform which can cater to multiple workloads right you have time series you have graph you have geospatial you need ai ml capabilities you want search right so there are n number of different things which are getting added new use cases are getting added so you need a kind of data platform which can cater to all these workloads right and it should be as easy as possible you should not have any operational overhead it should be quickly uh, provisioned for the enterprise and you should be able to quickly roll out and once you have the applications out you have large amount of data coming in so you need to make sure that the data is basically used this process is transformed uh, insights is driven from that data and not only insights getting driven you need to make sure that that insights is kind of going back to the business in the right way at the right time right so that is the key thing so you need to make sure that you have a system which can cater to all these phases of data life cycle and that is where the industry is going towards so they are moving from these legacy systems which are very rigid and which are kind of hindering their application development to a data platform which is very flexible which is easy for developers to work on right so that is the main trend i see in the data uh, industry in organizations so uh, i talked about competitive advantage before if you if you see um, company is still running on on premise right? so you can see how much time it takes to provision your servers if you have to build a new application even just doing that infrastructure setup might take weeks together but companies don't have time now they have to build the first version of application like within few days uh, uh, versus like few months which was before right so you need that base where you can provision a database in like say 5 minutes right so you need the entire application stack set up within few minutes and you can straight away get started with your application development you can't wait so the cloud provides you that platform right where you can just spin up your clusters today on day one i might not know my workloads you can start with serverless on cloud and you can straight away get started with your application and tomorrow you know whatever your workloads so you can scale according to it and you have some peak days you you don't know what is the number of users coming in for your website or your uh, application so you can auto scale based on the requirement so cloud provides that flexibility for you in terms of availability scalability right and of course you also have capability to kind of uh, uh, consume lot of as a service things either it is platform as a service software as a service and what not right which the luxury which you don't have in the on premise system so it is inevitable for any customers uh, in today's world to move to cloud to kind of move with the business faster right so build applications more intelligent applications and of course make sure that applications are resilient highly available and scalable so uh, if you see uh, in the current world uh, what is the costliest thing developers and most valuable and costliest uh, thing is developers right so mongodb is built with a uh, uh, principle of developer productivity right so it is uh, under the hood the document data model which provides a unified interface for the developers to kind of handle multiple workload type either it is document graph geospatial uh, tabular and of course document which is underlying so you can kind of handle all these with our unified query language you can handle different types of applications either it is distributed serverless or uh, the mobile first application doesn't matter and the key part is in terms of developers it is easy and intuitive for the developers to think and code with mongodb document data model being very closely related to object oriented programming paradigm right so that is the other part and the last part is last but not the least there so uh, it is a full proof tested platform which can run anywhere you can start in, on your private cloud you can go to public cloud on all three major cloud provider it runs the same everywhere it provides a sense of freedom to run anywhere for developers and architects who are running this platform right so mongodb is a data platform which can help you in building uh, all these kind of workloads with additional capabilities of like 
mobile and then data lake and search and everything built in as one single data platform with which you can eliminate a polyglot architecture which is very difficult to manage in terms of cost and complexity if MongoDB is not there. So it is always suggested to go with MongoDB data platform if you want to build any modern application for that matter. Thank you.